Praise the Lord Church. Today's Bible meditation is taken from Ezekiel chapters 29 and 30. If you're new to Living God family, a very warm welcome to you in Jesus' name. Hope this video will be a blessing to you as you hear and listen to the thoughts as we read through the Bible together. I encourage you to read the chapters during your personal devotion time and become recipients of listening to God's voice daily. Ezekiel chapter 30 verses 1, 2 and 3. The word of the Lord came to me, son of man, prophesy and say, this is what the sovereign Lord says, wail and say, alas for that day, for the day is near, the day of the Lord is near, a day of clouds, a time of doom for the nations. God the Almighty intervenes in the affairs of his people as a warrior and as a judge. The day of the Lord is near and his judgment comes through in different ways with the end time invasion through wars, drought, famine and nations under pressure. While there is still time during this grace period, let us repent and come into Christ's fold to escape God's fiery wrath and live with him for eternity. As we read in Matthew chapter 24 verses 4 through 14, And Jesus answered them, See that no one leads you astray. For many will come in my name, saying, I am the Christ, and they will lead many astray. And you will hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that you are not alarmed, for this must take place, but the end is not yet. For nation will rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom, and there will be famines and earthquakes in various places. All these are but the beginning of the birth pains. Then they will deliver you up to tribulation and put you to death, and you will be hated by all nations for my name's sake. And then many will fall away and betray one another and hate one another. And many false prophets will arise and lead many astray. And because lawlessness will be increased, the love of many will grow cold. But the one who endures to the end will be saved. And this gospel of the kingdom will be proclaimed throughout the whole world as a testimony to all nations. And then the end will come. Praise be to our wonder-working God. In Jesus' name, Amen. Thank you for the privilege of your time in watching the videos and being part of Living God community. God bless you all abundantly as we are all created to be holy and happy in Christ Jesus. Amen.